Yeah, that car wasn't going that fast. It was going fast for SUV. You know what I mean? So uh it, it was moving. It was definitely moving, but oh, oh yes, sir. Okay. There was nothing fake about that. <laughs> Man, it's your boy Hemi Life 44 back with another video. If you're new to this channel, make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe, and browse. We're going up our 2020, and I do mean our 2020, baby. You understand me? Uh, I apologize about the wind noise, that's why I'm talking kind of loud right now because I don't know how bad it really is. But, 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 um, we just got to get this done. It's hot out here, it's like 100 plus. Said I wasn't gonna do this again, but I gotta do what I gotta do to keep bringing out content so. Then I got on all black, bro. Like, come on, bro. All black. I got on all black. Like, black shirt, black sweats. Look at that. Black sweats and everything. But, um, hey, um, if you're new to the channel, man, and you're not aware of the people that fix my credit, y'all, how live my guy LD? That's who works on my credit. That's who got everybody credit fixed that surround me, pretty much. But his number's down below. Y'all text him. And, man, if you not, if you not, it ain't free, bro. So don't be hitting him up talking about I give you a $100 fix. Bro, it costs. Just hit him up and see what it costs. But, bro, no, fixing your credit is not cheap, bro, unless it's some illegal type stuff. And that ain't even cheap. You know what I'm saying? But this is legit. He got a, a business website outlet. But uh, the easiest way to get in contact with him, I've, well, the easiest way that I know is through the uh, messaging. So that's why I put his number down below. Y'all text him. Also, man, if you want a pedal box, Make sure you call this number down below. Get that pedal box, man. Shout out to everybody that has bought a pedal box. Um, definitely, definitely um, getting a lot of positive feedback about it. Got a lot of people that's still trying to buy some now. But um, I'm trying to find this shade, bro. But <laughs> uh, y'all know what we doing today by the thumbnail and the title, man. I'm back on my car review type time. Let me stand right here. Let me stand right here. I'm back on my car review type time, man. So I am about to review this vehicle man y'all make sure y'all like and share this video because i'm out here in this heat doing this for y'all you know what i mean uh, um you know just make sure y'all like and share the video man like and share it and uh come in let me know what y'all want to see me review next i'm trying to get back into it I'm trying to get some uh more luxury type cars as well so y'all make sure y'all um y'all sharing this and liking it i'll let helps promote this video get it into other people um people that don't know who him in life is it put youtube put it in their face the better the video do that's why i asked y'all to like and comment on every video but uh with that being said man we're finna get right to this review yes sir. gangs out see what we have here is a 2019 tahoe um this is the premium well premiere i'm sorry the premiere 2019 chevy tahoe premiere this everything to come with man y'all know how to do it 
this beat me telling y'all what's in this vehicle y'all can just pause it right here or wherever you want to pause it at and y'all see what's in this vehicle um i will say now this vehicle is probably this one has thirty-five thousand miles on it brand new this vehicle is like seventy thousand seventy thousand dollars so i'm i'm guessing this vehicle is right around 55 you know what i mean by fifty-five thousand. don't quote me because i don't know the price that they have on it but you can be looking somewhere in the fifty thousand range it's maybe 49 type stuff Thirty-five thousand miles is really nothing man so and you're still getting an amazing truck this truck is black on black as y'all can see that's what i like about it the most i'm not gonna well no when i saw it this is what i liked about it the most but once i got in it it's something on the inside that i like way more than the black on black but i am a chevy tahoe fan i'm gonna walk around as i talk about it i am a chevy tahoe fan man i do like tahoes i always have like tahoes especially these new body styles i like the box shape of suvs i like box shaped suvs man they just look this and the escalade is my favorite too uh type suvs i do like these rims man i believe these are 22s um yeah 22 i like those rims man you know if y'all come by this vehicle man tell them to put some more tires on her because those tires are out of there which they'll do that anyway but those tires are out of there bro there's no no life left on those almost but these wheels are nice 22 we got premier right here on the back in black it's black on black so Everything is blacked out. That's the premier. Um, let's pop the back. I hope I left it unlocked. I did. So it goes up by itself. Um, got your little mats back here. You know, they take them out so people test drive the vehicle and all that. Just keeps them clean so people won't be stepping out on them. Um, you got a little compartment down there. Uh, these seats do go down right here you let them i think this the which one is this that's for that one up there i push this one that's for that one let me see this should be the other one yes sir so you just push that they go down let's do this one now so that one goes down this one you hold this one to get this one down and I'll let it come back up the same way. Of course, you got cup holder right here. Cup holders back here. You got your AC back here for the kids as well. Up there, you got vents right there, vents right in the middle. You got vents for every row. We're gonna let these back up. I'm gonna hold both of them at the same time. Like so. I'm gonna hold both. I don't think you can let these back up. You can't let them back up. You gotta manually let these seats back up. But we're gonna go up there and talk about it. Um, where we at? Where's the button? Push the button right here. Button right here lets that back down and it goes down on its own. Blacked out Chevy symbol. Blacked out bow tie as we say. <laughs> you know what I mean? Gas tank on the left hand side. Uh, you got the step, step rails. Your uh, running boards right here, whatever. Then let's open up this back. Wow, I only got the front unlocked. Wow, wow. Luckily, I got the keys in my pocket. Hold on, let's see. Unlock, I unlocked it. Okay, let's see if that unlocked the back. Yes, it did. So we're gonna let these back up manually. And like I told y'all, man, some on the inside I like about this truck the most, and that is this. These seats are brown, man. It's like a, it's crazy. That looks so amazing. That looks amazing, man. I love it. I love that. That looks nice. A lot of it's a lot of space in here, man. It's roomy. Let me let this one up. Oh, it's roomy, man. Um, I got this seat kind of far back. Cause if y'all follow me on Instagram, I just made an Instagram on my story. Well, I just made a story on my Instagram too. But I got this seat far back, and I'm right here comfortable, bro. I'm right here. My knee is right here, but I'm leaning back too. You know what I mean? I'm kind of sitting down in the seat. I was kind of sitting down like up here, kind of slaps down so kids will be fine little spot right there sounds speakers down there bro i don't know what kind of sound system in here but it is amazing like it's crazy you got the tv right here push that button lay it down for the kids 
You know what I mean? So nice, man. You got a sunroof. Sunroof up there. You got all your buttons, your windows right here. Man, it is hot, bro. It is hot. I'm gonna show you how bad I'm sweating in a minute. Um, seat memory right here. This is where you control the seat set in the front. You got your mats up here. Um, you got my apple juice right there that I got so much gotta have. I like I like everything about this truck, bro. I like it. It looks good. It's crazy. Um let's pop the hood. This is what's up under the hood. 6.2 liter, man. 420 horses, man. This truck is 420 horses. And it, it I mean it'll move. It's a heavy truck. It's like 5,600 pounds. So 420 horses is not gonna move this truck the way it'll move a car. But it still get up and do what it needs to do. Nice and clean. They got it nice and clean down there. Y'all in the comments, let me know what y'all think about this, this tile, man. I'm a fan of it. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm a fan of it. I like it. I like it. I like the front headlights on. I like the whole setup of the vehicle. I like this whole setup, man. I really do. But in order to get this vehicle, and in order to get any Dodge vehicle that you want, you must come to Forest Lane CDJR, man. Y'all know we had come to them. They would take care of you. Shout out to the guy. One of my subscribers just came and bought a red scat pack. A 2020, that scat pack I showed y'all. He came and bought it. One of my subscribers. So shout out to you, bro. I forgot your name, but they called me when you bought it. And uh, I kind of talked to him on speakerphone or whatever. But yeah, man, shout out to you, man. Congratulations on that. That was a nice pickup, brother. But this thing is nice, man. Y'all get a good look at that thing, man. Very nice. I like it. I like it. We're gonna get in. We're gonna start her up. Bro, look how, I don't know if y'all can tell how bad I'm sweating. Now, I normally don't do this, bro, but don't, it's only, it's for one reason. Let's show y'all how bad I'm sweating. Look at my stomach, bro. Look at that. I'm just showing y'all what I'm doing, what I'm going through out here. That's how it is. Ooh. Yes, sir. AC already on. I gotta let me cool down a little bit then. I'll turn the AC down. I know it's loud right now. But uh let me cool down a little bit. And I'll turn it on. Woo, turn it off. Let's turn it down son. Turn it down for y'all. So y'all can hear. Oh, they got it booming. Okay, y'all, so I've cooled down a little bit. That that AC, I don't know how to control the back. Oh, I don't know how to control the rear AC. How to turn that down? It's probably, oh, here we go. Ah, oh, okay, I got it, I got it. So it's a lot more quieter in here now. Let me let this seat back. Why I keep scooting up like that? I gotta redo this every single time. I hit the gas a little bit. But uh, let me, I'm gonna turn it around so y'all the, the gauges and everything about the uh, the inside of the vehicle up front. So this is the cockpit, man. You know, Chevy, Chevy gauges pretty much look the same. They like this in all the trucks too. So y'all, if y'all don't see any of the trucks, they the same, bro. They don't change them up too much. Push the push start, of course. But yeah, you got all the, you got your AC controls right here. All your controls right here, man. All that. This is where you control the, the back AC. Turn it up and down right here. Y'all hear it coming on back there. But this is where you control it. This is where you control your uh, seat climate and all this and that. Heated and cool seats right here for both sides. Um, yeah, so. Oh, it's 99. It feels like it's hotter than 99 out here. But uh, yeah, man. I'll show y'all the little space. It's always just a little space in these SUVs and trucks. I don't understand it. But you got little compartments down here. Um, I think this is where you can charge your phone. And you sit your phone right there, your phone charge. Uh, I don't know. I don't know how they work. It ain't never worked when I tried it. But uh, you got a lot of space in here. Take this out. Look, man, you got so much stuff. What is all this? Oh, bags and earphones for the uh, TV back there. So you can listen to what you want to listen to on the radio while your kids is watching TV with their earphones. Okay, and here go the original sticker. Show y'all the original sticker for the car. Show y'all the original sticker. God, stop it, I can't get it open. See if I was right about this. Woo, I'm sorry, I lied to y'all. 
that truck sitting at five thousand. But that's the uh, that's the brand new cost. So for this truck, man, you gonna be paying about fifty five for sure. You definitely gonna be paying about fifty five for it. I can tell you that. For the gas, I don't know why they got it in here. This is for your gas, man. When you run out of gas, you gotta put this in there. This man, it's self-explanatory once you run out of gas, really. But yo, you got a lot of space in here. You got your USB and your uh, cigarette lighter right here. Your little cup holders right here. More USB cigarette lighter. This one don't have a plug in it. Some of these vehicles got actual plugs, but this one don't. So uh, sunroof right here. You control outlet right here. Um, this is where you uh, connect it to your garage and all that. So we finna um. We finna go and drive it. Woo! Let's go and drive this thing, man. Let's see, show y'all. Let y'all know how it ride from a Dodge Charger on a perspective. You know what I mean? Like I say, I'm a fan of these. I ain't gonna go that way in water that way. But this interior is crazy, bro. I'm really feeling this interior. Hey, I forgot to take my thumbnail. That's YouTube, man. I'm finna bag up. <laughs> Put a bag up and take my thumbnail right quick. Then I'm gonna restart this video. I'm gonna start it right back. See, this is what we do. This is what you gotta do in YouTube, man. I straight forgot to take my thumbnail, bro. I gotta come out some. I gotta come way out some too. But I straight forgot, bro. It's so hot out here. He got me thinking wrong. I'm gonna go right here, right here. We're finna take this thumbnail right quick and I'll start it back. So boom, straight like that, thumbnail recorded. Thumbnail taken, man. Hey, let me tell y'all a good way to get dope pictures. And I don't know if anybody do this, but I do it sometimes. This is how you get dope pictures, man. Just set your phone up. If you're taking it on your own, set your phone up and uh, just put it on record. Like, you know how you want to get off guard pictures and all this and that? Just take, put your phone on record and just, like, just walk around in, in front of the camera. You know what I'm saying? Or do different poses in front of the camera and go back to the video and pause it. You'll never get those type of, uh, you'll never get those type of um, off guard pictures if you don't do that. You know what I mean? Just take the video. Take the video, pause it, where a, a throwed off guard thumbnail or a off guard picture is, and just uh, screenshot it. Don't say I ain't never told y'all nothing, man. That's how you get them dope off guard pictures, though. Just record it and then pause the video and screenshot it. But uh, yeah, right now we in this Tahoe thing. I got the right away at this stop sign, so I'm gonna go and go. But this thing is. Uh, Amazing, brother. Rides very nice. Rides very nice. I'm actually running over some, it's kind of bumpy right here, but you don't even feel it. You don't even feel it. When you buying these type of cars, people be like, oh, this car is oh, high. This, this car too much money. This car this, this car that. That's, you, I mean, you paying for stuff you don't see as well. Like, you, like I don't know if y'all ever rode in a Bentley. If anybody ever rode in a Bentley or a, a, a high dollar Cadillac or any type of luxury car, Bro, them cars ride totally different. The suspension on them ride totally, it's totally different. Like, them cars feel like you in just, bro, it's it's amazing. They feel totally different. So you paying for stuff that you don't see, too. So when these cars high, I don't think they just jacking up the prices like that. You, I mean, it's stuff really done to these cars. But uh, like this custom brown interior in here, this ain't just what come in every Tahoe. You ain't gonna see this in every Tahoe. You know what I mean? But it's nice. I, I like this. It's actually comfortable. And I'll let. Let me hit the gas. Oh yeah, it pick up. It ain't no, it ain't no, no race car, nothing. But if you need to get over, you know what I'm saying? Car won't let you over. You get a little, you can get over. You put a pedal box on this thing, then you you in there. You know what I'm saying? Pedal box can't go on tie holes too. If you want it, you understand know I me? Mean? They can get it for you. But this thing nice. Bro, it's so hot outside. I don't even have this open. Like, I know I normally had this. I keep this open. I done had it closed on my car. And that's a surprise. 
that's, that comes as a surprise to me because I don't know to do that. That's how you know it is very, very hot. But um, this car ride, this vehicle ride's good, bro. I like it, bro. I tell, I tell Scapet Black, and I tell Miles and them all the time, bro. Text me before you call. I be recording. They don't, they don't listen to me. They don't listen to me. They just stay the car, brother. Text me. Don't call me, text, bro. If anybody won't get in touch with me, you got a better chance of getting in touch with me by text message. Like, don't call me. Reason being, a lot of times I'm recording, and a lot of times, bro, my I'm on the phone so much. Like, bro, it's like sometimes my I ain't done it, but I'm just gonna make an example. My mama could call me, and I look at the phone and be like, man, I call you back. I ain't never done that to my mom, but I've done that to people before because I've been on the phone so long. It's like, bro, I'm tired of holding this phone. I call you back, bro. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I done done that. I done done that before. I ain't, I ain't got nothing, bro. I ain't, you know what I'm saying? I ain't saying to you nothing. I tell you to your face, look, yeah, I, yeah, you called me, yeah, I looked at the phone, and I say I ain't want to answer. But I ain't done too many people like that. But I done done it before. Let me over, or I'll jump over on you. You know, I'm in Big Tahoe, you understand me? Y'all, you look hard, y'all gotta move out the way. Big dog coming through. But, uh, yeah, man, if y'all want this vehicle, y'all come up to, um, uh, Forest Lane CDJR, man. Y'all holler at Rico, or if you want any vehicle that you ever see, I review, because that'll be where I'm reviewing cars at for right now. Or any Dodge vehicle, man. If you want a Dodge vehicle, you gotta come here. Like, I done had three subscribers buy a car from here already. Shout out to all y'all, man. But um, since I've been reviewing it, I feel like this is pretty good. And more more people that came up here, they just, you know, wasn't able to buy the car they wanted or whatever. Which we all done been through that. I done been through that. Went to the dealership, wasn't ready. They told me, nah, your credit ain't good enough. That's why I tell y'all, I let my guy LD, man. But uh, yeah, so y'all want this vehicle, y'all come up to uh, CD, uh, Forest Lane, CDJR, and ask for Rico. Rico will point you in the right direction. He'll get you to the salesman that's gonna take care of you, man. I promise you that. Um, but yeah, y'all get in the comments, y'all let me know what y'all think about this. I really love how this car drives and everything. It feels good. Let me hit it right here since it's a little. Oh yeah. I'm at 75 already. I I was just I'm at nah this pickup for a Tahoe. Now like I said, don't go by my reaction. I was surprised that it picked up the way it did for an SUV. Now, <laughs> that reaction may have been like, man, that car wasn't going that fast. It was going fast for an SUV. You know what I mean? So, uh, it, it was moving. It was definitely moving, but. Oh, oh, yes, sir. Okay. Now, there wasn't nothing fake about that. <laughs> Say, hey, okay. You know what I'm saying? Hey, that's when you can really feel that horsepower when you're going slow and you playing with it. You playing, ooh. Ooh. Yeah, it got, it got a little power, man. 420, man. 420 horse. Uh, I forgot the torque. Maybe 500 something pounds for your torque, I believe. But definitely, definitely worth buying. I feel like I want one. It's gonna either, if I get an SUV, it's gonna either be this or it's gonna be I think my car's looking good over there. It's gonna be this, or it's gonna be a um a, a Escalade, which is an Escalade right here. I'm from the park behind. It's another Escalade right there. But this jump right here, y'all finna see that white Escalade right there. It'll be an Escalade, or it'll be a Tahoe if I buy an SUV. But uh, yeah. So I'm finna get back in my car and go to that crazy up because I got so much to do today. It's crazy. So, um, let me park this. Ooh, don't hit that Escalade. I might be buying it. You understand me? You understand me? Yes, sir. I got used to this camera, bro. They they reverse cameras is way different from our. Shit, that's, that's Chevy, period. They cameras is different. I don't like their cameras. Oh, we're going to get close as possible. But, yes, sir. So, hey, man. That will be a wrap for this video, man. Y'all make sure y'all comment.
Y'all make sure y'all like, share, comment, all that. Um, share the video, like the video. We're going about 2020. Let me know in the comments what video you want to see. Don't get in here saying I want to see a, a scat pack or a 2020 charger. Because if, if, if you do that, all I'm going to tell you is, brother, browse my channel. I done done every Mopar is to do. Every SRT, every track hawk, every Hellcat, every wide body. I done done them all, bro. Y'all just got to uh, go through my channel. That's why, man, they got scat packs right here. They got an RT right here, 2020s. They got uh, uh, some V6. I done done everything it is to do when it comes to Chargers, Challengers, uh, Jeep Cherokees and um dodge rams i done done the rebel i done done the um 2500 i done done 3500 like come on man y'all grab my channel man but uh we finna get up off for it so i appreciate y'all watching man make sure y'all share this video but y'all know i ain't all my videos man in the meantime in between time to the next video hey wait a minute y'all make sure y'all uh uh check out my boy on instagram man it's another one of his shirts um underscore d-r-d-e man that's his ig Check him out, man. Dope uh, merch. I actually like this shirt. Uh, he sent me three shirts three days ago, and I done wore out three already. <laughs> I like them. But say, that's going to be real. I appreciate y'all watching, man. Y'all know I know my videos. In the meantime, in between time, to the next video, I'll let you boy, man. Yes, sir.